can avoid going outside in dangerous temperatures like what we saw today, experts want you to stay safe. KCU 9's Jessica Watson braved the conditions this afternoon and tells us how you can take on the heat without overheating. Now that summer is finally here, there's a lot of precautions that need to be made before you step outside. Drink lots of water. <laughs> and we don't stay out for too long. It gets way too hot pretty fast. Bailey Quinn says she wanted to get out of the house with her family this Sunday. Pretty warm. Um, we haven't been out too long, so it's not too bad. But um, yeah, it's nice out. I'm enjoying the the sun after all the rain we've gotten. From a wet spring to a hot and humid summer in days, officials say it's important to be prepared for the heat. So you still want to get outside. It's beautiful. It's the summer, but uh, you gotta, you gotta, you know, be safe in, in the in the warm weather. Brian says you can still go out and have fun on a hot day if you plan accordingly. I try to avoid the the heat in the middle of the day. Work out early in the morning or late at night uh, when the sun's down. And I, uh, you know, listen to my body. If my body's, if I'm dehydrated and my, I'm dizzy and nauseous, go inside and cool down. That's a, that's a big thing to kind of stay in safe when I'm outside um, in the heat. One tip is to also wear loose-fitting, light-colored clothing to avoid both heat and sunburns. And of course, wearing sunscreen will also protect you from those sun rays. I'm gonna take the little guy out to have some fun on a nice day before it gets too hot. Parks and Recreation officials say the pool is one of the perfect places to stay cool this season. In Sioux City, Jessica Watson, KCAU 9 News.